This is interesting. Early electrical appliances, so like everything we use today that uses electricity, caused severe injury as we were still working out the kinks in the technology. In the 1800s, electrical grids were installed for lights. Each home had a socket in the ceiling that would have the light bulb plug in. Over time, electrical appliances were made and they would plug into that socket instead of the light bulb. There were no off switches since there was just that one socket so people would unscrew it if they weren't using the appliance so they could use something else. When the washing machine was created in 1908, it went outside and the plug went into the house and into the ceiling socket. But there were some issues like caught hair and things like that. And since there were no off switches, people were seriously injured because the cord was all the way inside. They couldn't unplug the machine. So the early versions of electrical appliances were extremely primitive in a variety of ways. And it took some trial and error to smooth out the kinks. But what would we do now if we hadn't continued with electrical appliances? What if we had just stopped at the light bulb? Jeff Bezos used this story in his 2003 TED talk, making an analogy to the advent of the internet. He was looking for guidance for Amazon, and though at the time many people compared the internet to the gold rush, he realized that electricity was actually a better comparison. The gold rush was zero sum and finite. Electricity presented boundless opportunity, with some early hiccups. He was right, and this story applies to AI as well. There might be some early hiccups in the beginning, but those will be worked out, and in a hundred years we'll look back and say, thank god we didn't stop at the beginning.